If you suffer from chronic acid reflux, you're not alone. In fact, 21 million Americans experience heartburn and other symptoms of acid reflux two or more times per week. Heartburn is the most common symptom, but you may also be suffering from sore throat, persistent cough, regurgitation, hoarseness, inability to sleep lying flat, dental erosions, or asthma-like symptoms. If you experience these symptoms twice a week or more, you may have a condition known as GERD. GERD stands for gastroesophageal reflux disease. It's more commonly referred to as acid reflux. I'll wake up in the middle of the night gurgling acid. Um, my throat is burning. Um, I, don't, I don't like that feeling. Laura Callow-Jury, a nurse for 27 years, has been suffering from acid reflux for 15 years. Gertrude Green has been suffering for 20 years and tried nearly everything to control her reflux. Over that period of time, I have taken over-the-counter medications, medications by prescription, and seen more than one doctor. There would be days when I would wake up in the morning and my throat felt so raw that um, it was difficult to talk. For 26-year-old Erin Bennard, talking is her profession. She's a stage actress whose acid reflux was giving her much more than the usual symptoms. Reflux can give people heartburn, but it also has been associated with an increased risk of esophageal cancer. I actually was starting to have vocal problems. I just knew that I was feeling like not so much heartburn, but regurgitation in my throat. Um, was getting a lot of sore throats and um, sometimes hoarseness. And I knew that certain foods triggered it more but it seemed like after a while, everything was triggering it, and which was getting frustrating. In a healthy person, a natural barrier exists between the esophagus and the stomach that prevents stomach contents from flowing back up into the esophagus. This is called the anti-reflux barrier. A critical component of the anti-reflux barrier is a valve that opens and closes. Patients like Aaron with GERD generally have a deteriorated dysfunctional anti-reflux valve that cannot close. While medications such as H2 blockers and proton pump inhibitors, or PPIs, can suppress acid production to alleviate heartburn symptoms, they won't restore the natural anatomy of the anti-reflux valve. As the disease worsens, many people need to increase their medication. Worse yet, GERD sufferers are faced with the expense and possible adverse effects of taking pills for the rest of their lives. The PPIs, first it helps, but after five years, there is a certain group of patients who have no benefits of PPI anymore. There are also side effects of PPIs, and causing osteoporosis, hip fractures, gas bloating in the bowels, Fortunately, by surgically reconstructing the natural anti-reflux valve, a lifelong regimen of medication can be avoided. Conventional GERD surgery has proven an effective solution, but for many, the invasive nature of open or laparoscopic surgery is a deterrent. The esophix TIF procedure reconstructs the natural anti-reflux valve, addressing both the cause and the symptoms of GERD without incisions. No more pain, no more pills. The breakthrough of this procedure is simply that it requires no incisions. The patient can have the surgery done one day and literally return to full work the next day. TIF stands for transoral incisionless fundoplication. Transoral means that the procedure is performed through the mouth. As a result, esophix TIF is a giant leap forward in the treatment of GERD. The esophix TIF procedure is based on surgical principles of over 50 years of successful anti-reflux surgery. The procedure restores the natural anatomy of the anti-reflux barrier, but without incisions. There is no visible scarring, no cutting or dissecting of the natural anatomy, no risk of incisional infection or herniation. The result is an effective treatment with reduced risk and faster recovery. This device eliminates the need for any incisions whatsoever, and the entire reconstruction or rebuilding of the valve can be done from the inside, all with an instrument through the mouth. The esophix TIF procedure is performed in the hospital under general anesthesia. The device and a small video camera are inserted through the mouth into the stomach. Under visual control, 
the surgeon pulls and then fastens a long tissue fold and continues to extend the fold until a long and tight anti-reflux valve is constructed, creating a barrier to heartburn, regurgitation, and the other uncomfortable symptoms of reflux, and restoring the natural anatomy of the lower esophagus. There's essentially no pain with the procedure. It takes about an hour to do. Clinical results have been excellent. Two years after having the procedure, 79% of patients are off their daily medication, and 60 to 80% are able to eat and drink whatever they want to, including fatty and spicy foods, coffee, alcoholic drinks, carbonated beverages, and chocolate, all without heartburn. I like to eat spicy food, and I like to have red wine, and I have to have chocolate. In addition to increased food choices, late night eating, and a more restful night's sleep, the TIF procedure significantly improves a patient's overall quality of life. Patients really love the transoral concept. What's uh, amazing to see is that um, directly after uh, ASOFIX procedure, people are again able to sleep uh, horizontally while they were uh, sleeping in a lot of pillows for many years before the procedure. I feel like I've been like let out of prison. Not to look, you know, it's not that extreme, but it's really, it's, it's great. If you'd like to get back to living without pills, without pain, and without invasive surgery, you now have an option. Esophix TIF, the next generation of minimally invasive surgical treatment for GERD.